That brooch is just perfect. It complements your youthful figure, Your Excellency. <laughs> well, I do my best to keep in shape. <laughs> Los Angeles is growing, Your Excellency, and it needs an alcalde to run it. My husband, Don Luis, is the right man for the position. Hmm. Well then, you'll be delighted, my dear Isabella. I shall appoint an alcalde. Mm. I shall name Don Alejandro de la Vega. What? Great idea, isn't it? Mm. You two, hurry up! I don't pay you just to stand around. <laughs> Inez, what are you doing here? <laughs> oh! Oh! Ugh. No, my name's Rosa. Excuse me, I'm terribly clumsy. This happens all the time. This is incredible. It's Inez de la Vega's perfect double. This is the opportunity I was looking for. I sailed here from Mexico City uh. and I'm looking for a job. I can read and write. I've had good schooling. I'm willing to do anything. Mm -hmm. Anything? I might have a job for you. Something rather special involving acting. It would be to play a little joke on somebody I know. <laughs> oh, fun! I'm actually good at acting. Just watch this. <laughs> Oops, excuse me. It happens to me all the time. Hmm. Never mind about that, my dear Rosa. You and I are going to do a little shopping. This dress fits me perfectly. Thank you, Doña Isabella. Expect people to call you Ines. Above all, don't act the least bit surprised. Hmm. Have you got the documents I gave you earlier? Don't you worry now. I know exactly what I have to do. I've memorized my line. <sighs> and speak no more than needed. Do you understand? Yes, yes, of course. <laughs> together. Hello, Senorita de la Vega. Hmm. <laughs> I could never wriggle it. <gasps> oh. <gasps> Excuse me, Senor. Thank you very much. Yes, Senorita de la Vega, you've dropped something. Hmm? <gasps> What's come over her? Oh, Captain! Uh, Captain! Captain Monasterio! <laughs> Hello, Captain Monasterio. What brings you all this way? Don Alejandro, you and all the De La Vegas are under arrest, sir, for high treason. What? Oh! This is ridiculous! <gasps> I, I'm sorry, Don Alejandro. And him? Forget him. He's not even a Vega. Now, go fetch that Don Diego. No, Captain, you've no right to do this. He's done nothing wrong. Oh, you don't say. Signorita Ines, I think that you lost this out in front of my garrison. What? The garrison of Los Angeles will be attacked at nightfall, and Captain Monasterio will be shackled, etc., and etc. It's a plot against the army! No! It wasn't me! Come now, Captain. You can't be serious. Let's have no more lies. Everyone saw her. Furthermore, it's signed by you, Don Alejandro. Toss him in prison. Uh, get your hands off me! <sighs> All right, I understand. Let's try to figure it out first. To go upstairs. Corporal, yes, you go check the stables, and I'll, uh, I guess I shall simply give the kitchen a thorough inspection. Rosa, you must stay inside this house until I come back to fetch you. Now, is that clear? 
You aren't playing a joke, are you, Doña Verdugo? You're actually up to no good. Otherwise, you wouldn't make me promise to stay in this musty old cabin. Mm -hmm. Oh, you've nothing to fear, dear Rosa. I've already told you. I'm not the one who has anything to be afraid of. It's you, right? If I told people in town what I'm doing for you... Oh, why on earth would you do that, sweet Rosa? I wouldn't do it at all. Hmm. If you were to give me bags full of pesos about this big... Whoa! Oh, you shall get what you deserve. Hmm. Nobody here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so delicious. <laughs> oh. Mm. Oh, get out of my kitchen, Sergeant! You certainly won't find Don Diego in my kettles! We haven't found Diego de la Vega, hmm. Sergeant. Me neither. Oh, that does it. Don Diego's not here! It's back to the barracks! Oh, thank you, Doña Maria! Ow. Hands off! That's for Don Alejandro and Senorita Ines. And when you bring it to them, it better still be full. Bernardo, what we need to do right now is prove my father and Ines are innocent. Hmm. For sure, Monasterio is capable of telling big fibs when he wants to get rid of our family, but not the Angelinos. So let's go ask them to tell us what they saw. It's a shame a pretty woman like you is bound for a labor <gasps> camp. Of course, I could set you free right now if you agreed to be Signora Monasterio. <clears throat> I'd sooner do hard labor. You will pay for that, Signorita. Yes, dearly. Uh, my poor little girl. Let's not lose hope, Father. We'll get out of here. Hear ye, hear ye, Captain of Los Angeles! In the presence of His Excellency, our venerable, honorable, Governor Don Esteban Parson. <laughs> the defendants Don Alejandro de la Vega, his daughter Ines, and his son Diego are judged guilty of committing high treason, plotting against the crown. Public disturbance, huh? contempt, and rebellion, defamation, and assaulting an officer of his majesty. <sighs> Consequently, all the possessions of the Vega estate are hereby confiscated. Don Alejandro, Ines, and Diego de la Vega are hereby sentenced to life in jail with hard labor. Your Excellency, we are innocent. Silence! Oh. Traitors aren't allowed to speak. Oh. Don Alejandro, I had faith in you. What a disgrace! But Captain Monasterio... D what? Huh? Oh! Huh? Hmm... Do not worry, Your Excellency. I will soon have captured the runaway Diego de la Vega. Thanks to me, these enemies of California will be put behind bars. Oh, I'm hungry! Carlos! So then, Ines dropped some papers on her way to the barracks. And then she ran away and fell flat on her face. Not once, but twice. That doesn't sound like her at all. Carlos! Hello! Oh, Diego! It's Don Diego! Catch him! Sir! Yes, sir, sir! Oh. Surrender, Don Diego. You will only get hurt. <laughs> Don Diego, come back here. Please, Don Diego, come back. Diego! Diego! <laughs> oh, no. My yummy sausages. <laughs> Sergeant, that will be five pesos. Today's special.
hadn't let Don Diego get away, we wouldn't be pulling guard duty tonight, Corporal. Me? I'm not the... And to think, we could be sitting now at Carlos's, enjoying a delicious tortilla. He has a brand new recipe. Everyone says it tastes like... Whoa! Zorro! Tastes like Zorro? No, there! Zorro! You're seeing Zorros everywhere, Sergeant. Oh, I'm so hungry that it's making me hallucinate. Documents accuse my family with patent falsehoods. Yes, but the faking nest managed to convince everybody. Who is she really? Who is she working for? We have to force our enemies to reveal themselves. Let's swing into action and help the prisoners escape. Surely you know we're innocent. You can't stand by idly and let them ship my father and my sister off into exile. You know we'd like to help you, Diego. But we have to think about our families. We'd put them in danger if we went against the governor and the captain. Don Alejandro is my oldest friend, and I will never let him down. Me neither. <laughs> Phew. I thought we'd wind up all alone. Why don't we invite the governor and the good captain over for a small party? Mm -hmm. It will be much easier if there are fewer soldiers in the barracks. What a good idea, my dear. Doña Isabella, I don't know how to thank you. Oh, it's not necessary. <laughs> now listen, you'll sneak in at night. Choose any bedroom at the inn in Los Angeles. You will stay hidden. Nobody must see you. I'll be on the plaza at dawn. When you see me open my red umbrella three times, you'll go out on the balcony and you will fire in the air above Governor <gasps> Parasol. Now don't worry, dear. It's just a small blast of powder, and the soldiers won't set out looking for you. Instead, they'd be looking for Ines de la Vega. You must really hate the entire de la Vega clan, but I don't mind. Just as long as I'm well paid. Otherwise... You will get lots of money, Rosa. You may have left Mexico City a pauper, but you'll go back as rich as a princess. <laughs> Oh, not again. Oops, excuse me. My dear friend, I just love receptions. In Monterey, we have the most wonderful ones. Bernardo, it's strange that Doña Verdugo should want to help us. Be very careful. You never know. Yeah. Listen up. Let the prisoners go. Alert! Zorro! Zorro! Oh, Gonzalez. <laughs> Don't bother, Corporal. It's just another hallucination. Hmm. <laughs> it's Zorro! I got Zed! We've all seen it's Zorro, Sergeant. Hey, you didn't see me this time. Later, Corporal. I promise I'll make it up to you. <laughs> I see him. Get him! I give up. You soldiers are just too smart for me. I'll be back soon. Catch him, Lancers! Yes, sir! This way! Come on, hurry! Hurry! Good work, Bernardo. Lucky for us, Zoro dropped by, huh? <laughs> Luis, you're always there for me. You would have done the same thing for me, Alejandro. Hurry, we need to hide. Bernardo told me everything. Thank you, Tyna. But where is Diego? Hiding, but he will find the guilty parties. Huh? They're all gone. And what about Zoro? Where is Zoro now? Oh, 
garrison's a big joke! We will track down the prisoners, Your Excellency. With all this, I'm missing my breakfast. Mm. My hot chocolate's cold by now. Huh? Sorrel, <laughs> arrest him! <laughs> I've just saved the governor, but no, don't thank oh, me. Look! Hmm. It's enough! Just a little bit higher! Hey! Ah, impressive! Over there! They're behind the end! Hurry up! I see him! Get that out of my way! Yes, sir! Over there! Over there! Capture Zoro! Not Ines de la Vega, Captain? Zoro! <laughs> I want Zoro! <laughs> what are you waiting for, Sergeant? Well, it's not like I can fly, Captain. Well, then, learn how to! Adios, Captain. Ooh. I think that you and this senorita will have lots to discuss. Adios! <laughs> ah, so we've caught our criminal. This time you won't escape your jail cell, senorita de la Vega. Hold on. Uh, I oh. am Ines de la Vega. What's going on? I don't know. This woman is an imposter. Oh. <laughs> <gasps> She's part of a larger plot to get my family accused of treason. Oh, Diego! <gasps> It is true. It's not my sister who dropped the plans of that conspiracy in front of your barracks, Captain. It's her. No! I'm Ines, and she's the criminal! Oh, no! It's me! Captain, you must believe me! I have had the honor of dancing with Ines de la Vega, and she is not at all clumsy. Arrest that girl! Sir, yes, sir. I've always known that you were innocent, Don Alejandro. Isn't that right, Captain? <gasps> mm -hmm. That's her! She hired me to say and do all this! Oh, how absurd! Whatever for? The de la Vegas are dear friends. Ines is like my little sister. This accusation is unfounded, Your Excellency. Doña Isabella is kind and loyal, thoroughly honest. Mm. That's enough! Mm. We'll investigate to find out all about your pathetic plot. For now, it's prison! <gasps> oh. Ow! Zowie! Hmm. Oh. You showed such extraordinary courage, Your Excellency. Uh, <laughs> mm. Nothing to it. Just my duty. I must leave you now. Yet with no alcalde to represent me, I do fear for Los Angeles. And you are my choice, Don Alejandro. <gasps> I'm... I'm overwhelmed, Don Esteban. Uh, but perhaps a better choice would be my friend Don Luis Verdugo, an honest ranchero whose sole desire is to serve Los Angeles. Well, so be it then. Henceforth, <laughs> you shall be alcalde of Los Angeles, Don Verdugo. An honor, Your Excellency. <laughs> Thank you, my friend. Long live Don Luis! Hooray! Hurrah for Don Luis! Hurrah for Los Angeles! She's so smooth. As usual, we can't prove a thing. Just you wait. We will, one day. Hurrah for Don Luis! Hurrah for Your Los Angeles! Thank you, Thank you. forever! <laughs>
Here is your own dream catcher. You shall see. It wards off the worst nightmares. It will help you sleep like a baby. <laughs> well, hello, everyone. <sighs> it's Sisquak! <laughs> when I grow up, I'll defend our village like Sisquak does. I'll snatch the captain on my stallion. And we'll feed him red army ants. Yeah! <laughs> 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 Sisquak has become a real hero. A hero in hiding. The moon has already crossed the sky twice, and Sisquak is still living on the mountain. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Captain Monasterio holds grudges, you know, and... <gasps> Make way! Visitors, oh. look there! <gasps> Soldiers! Leave no stone unturned. Sisquak isn't here. You will have mm. searched our village for nothing. <gasps> hmm. uh, he's not here, Captain. Hmm. Posture, <laughs> mind your posture. An enemy lurking could sneak up and surprise you. Oh, Captain, that Sisquak is so elusive. A man as important as you certainly must have bigger fish to fry. I'll wager if that poor devil's hiding, he's most likely scared. You know, scared of the powerful captain of Los Angeles. Obviously. My reputation. My military prowess. Oh, that smells good. Mm. May I? Hey! Oh. I suspect you are right. <laughs> We're wasting our time searching here. Lancers! Return to the garrison! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm. Hurry, you nincompoop! That was close. Mm. You don't suppose we may have left too hastily? <laughs> <laughs> of course we did! You just sit back and watch. That bowl Garcia mm? picked up was an important mm. clue. <laughs> Who do you think ate from it? Turn around, men! The fugitive is still here! Search the village! Know how Zoro's been keeping me busy these past few nights? Grab that man! Don't let him escape this time, or you'll be the ones going to prison! Sisquak, remember the name of the man who captured you Corporal Gonzalez! Nobody rush out! Follow orders. Be disciplined. Get back. That's an order. The fugitive surrenders to me, your sergeant. It's a good thing we can always count on the troops in Monasterio to bungle their maneuvers. Hmm. Huh? No! Let go, Corporal! You may move aside while I arrest this dangerous criminal! Now shoo! No! He's mine! I, I caught him! Hmm. Sisqua. The governor awaits you in Monterey. He'll ship you to a camp in the hottest place in Mexico. You will spend the rest of your life there breaking rocks! <laughs> no, it's not fair. Uh, Captain, we all know that revenge is bad for your health. You should give him a pardon. <laughs> a pardon? You must have read that in some book for pretty senoritas. <laughs> 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 Return to the garrison! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <sighs> Monasterio sending Sisquak to Monterey. He'll send him to a labor camp. If he does, then we'll never get Sisquak back. 
I'll travel to Monterey to speak to that governor, Don Parasol. Wait, Grandmother, that's a voyage that takes several days. I will go. No Chumash brave will rot in a labor camp. This is not the moment to sit on our rumps counting butterflies, my little darling. Grandma. Hush, and go fetch the outfit for Zorro. You sure? Hmm. Looks like she could eat Monasterio alive. <laughs> <laughs> Here I am. I went back to the house for a clean set of clothes. That way, I will look respectable in front of Don Parasol. Will this suit of clothes help you in liberating Sisquak? Indeed. You'll see. The suit I chose is magical. That palace over there is the governor's mansion. Huh? Ah! Oh. oh. Yeah. <laughs> Please, senor. Hmm. Oh, Don Diego. You came to say your final goodbyes to him. He'll be on the first boat to a labor camp. He is not on that ship hmm. yet. <laughs> hmm. Don Diego, Senorita Ines, what brings you here? Your Excellency, I've come to beg you to pardon the young brave Sisquak. Oh, no, not that boring story again. The case is closed, Senora. <laughs> it's way too sugary. I'm never going to serve that at my receptions. <sighs> It's delicious. Oh my, you are so right, Sergeant. They're delicious. Mm. Your Excellency, for months mm. now, Sisquak has lived in the mountains alone, far from his tribe and family. Don't you think that that is sufficient punishment? No! Mm. That warrior attacked an officer of His Majesty's army. He deserves to be sent away. Governor, only a pardon will allow us all to live in peace. <laughs> be quiet, will you? Mm. Hush up! I don't want to hear any more talk about that sick sook. That Indian's name's unpronounceable. I have a reception two days from now, <laughs> and nothing's ready! <laughs> it's awful! And I have horrible nightmares every night! Nightmares? I have a solution to your problem, Your Excellency. Please accept this dream catcher as a gift from the Chumash Nation to guard your sleep. <laughs> Devilish idolatries! They bring bad luck! Don't be afraid, Your Excellency. Not only will you no longer have nightmares, but this dream catcher will help you make it a great reception that people will never forget. It will? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, of course, in exchange, we need to appease the spirits the Chumash way by giving a warrior back to the Chumash. Like Sisquak, for example. Wait, you can't possibly... If... Of course, Sisquak will apologize to the captain in public. Hmm. <sighs> Many thanks, Don Diego. I order the man's immediate release. Huh? Mm. Oh, but if he does it again, Captain Monasterio mm. may have him exiled. Oh. Hmm. I apologize, Captain Monasterio. What? This is a travesty! Many, many thanks, my friends. It is him, but I... He kind of let him go! <laughs> I'll go with you. We'll need a lot of wood for the fire. Those tracks lead straight to Monterey. Oh, 
Mysterio will surely have Sisquok shipped away if we don't catch up with them. Ride with the wind. An aging woman like me would only slow you down. I will sing to implore the spirits to protect you. Go on, Diego. We'll stay and detain them. Games begin. Nobody can board. Those are the orders. I promised my grandmother to come check with Captain Monasterio to see if anyone has found Sisquok. He disappeared, and Grandma's very worried. Senorita hmm. de la Vega. What a surprise. <laughs> what? Don Diego couldn't join you? Diego was at the governor's. We're looking for Sisquok. Do you know where he is? Your Indian is about to sail off on a nice long voyage hmm. in the ship's hold hmm. to a labor camp in Mexico. Ooh. What do you mean? The governor pardoned him. <laughs> if he stayed out of trouble. But you see, he has now been charged with insulting the governor. Uh, or is it horse theft? Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, oh, no, Captain. We made an obituary arrest. Um, no. What was it? Oh, yeah. Arbitrary. That's the word you said. Mm. Oh, my goodness. That means that Sisquok did no wrong and should oh. go free. Isn't that what? right, Captain? Hmm. Garcia, that's one hey. month on manure oh. duty for you. Oh. Captain, hmm. at least allow me to see Sisquak. Unfortunately, this ship will soon lift its uh. anchor, and we must uh. stow the gangway. Wait! Oh. Well now, Captain, oh. are you already leaving California without so much as a farewell? Oh my, it's mm. that awful Zorro. Zorro, you too belong in a <laughs> labor camp. Lancers! Arrest him! Yes, sir! Come on! Attack. Oh, catch him! Attack! Catch him! Catch him! Halt, Zoro! Senorita de la Vega! Oh, what have I done? Gafan! Smelling salts, quick! Oh dear! Oh dear! Oh. Hmm. Inez! Hmm. Oh. Water. Water? Uh, water? You're right away, Senorita! <laughs> Here's some water. Wait, what are you doing? You can't go in there. That's Captain's orders. <laughs> Any other takers for a midnight swim? <laughs> Is it raining jars here or what? <laughs> Feeling a bit fatigued. <laughs> no, no. I cannot let you see your friend. Look, Sisquok! He just got <laughs> in! He's swimming away! What? Where? I don't see any. Not again! Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> Zoro! <laughs> I'm here! Oh, oh, I mean over here! I'll get him! Oh, Zoro! Hmm. 
here, Captain. Ah! Captain! Where is Sisquok? He isn't in the hold. <laughs> he isn't there. We put him in a place that you would never guess. Captain, that Indian, Sisquok, isn't in the hold. Well, of course he's not down there, Sergeant. Because he's on board the Santa Clara. Oh. That ship oh. over there that's preparing... Be quiet, you fool. <laughs> Thank you for the information, Corporal. <laughs> huh? He's amazing. <gasps> oh. Give it a good mm -hmm. look. Your dear California. Mm. You won't ever see it again. Is this the ship <gasps> offering the free trip to Mexico? <laughs> I've always wanted to see the pyramids. Zorro! <laughs> You've come to lose to the greatest of all fencing masters. You mean you're the best fencing master we've got? Ah, I see. That explains why the Lancers can't wield a sword. What? Take that b back! Zoro! <laughs> Get back! Don't go near this prisoner! Not even like this? Or may I do it like this? <laughs> We got it! Stand back! He's all mine. <laughs> you might have to try to catch me first, Maestro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One point for Zorro. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, Zorro. <laughs> I'll take that. Just be in your way up here. Here, I'll show you who's best with a sword. Up here. Wow, impressive. Oh, good thrust. Very elegant. You think you can show me that again? <laughs> Impressive. I can't wait to see your grand finale. Oh my! That's an unusual way to attack. Soldiers, help! I'm scared of heights! Hurry, Sisquak. Dive in and swim to shore. Thanks a lot, Sorrow. Wait! Mm. <laughs> Don't try to hide or flee, Zoro! Come back and fight like a man! Oh, I'm right uh, over here. No, <laughs> I want down! <laughs> As you wish, Maestro. No! <laughs> Ouch! <laughs> <laughs> I'm so relieved you escaped. Diego, where have you been, dear boy? At the Presidio, with 
hours of waiting before I could see the governor, only to find out that Sisquak had already been set free by that cad, Zoro. Zoro and I fought off a bunch of soldiers. Oh, life's so unfair. I never get to watch the fun stuff. Zoro must be aware that Diego objects to any fighting and very considerately waits for Diego to leave before he strikes. Sure, Grandmother. That must be it. <laughs> <laughs>